preparing for the worst. You can expect to see a lot of emergency crews today along the shores of Lake Michigan. They'll be training for different types of disasters, including a mock plane crash in the water. WISN 12 News' Hillary Mintz is live in Milwaukee with a look ahead. Good morning, Hillary. Good morning, Melinda. You know, if you've flown in or out of Mitchell International, you know that you go right over the water. And while you hope and you pray you make it to that runway, well, emergency crews just want to make sure that if anything were to ever happen, a plane would crash right off the shore here of McKinley Marina. They need to know how to get to you in time and save you, hopefully. Now, the mock mask rescue starts at 830 this morning and is expected to last about two hours. More than 20 different agencies will team up with first responders from the Coast Guard and practice rescue efforts. And the scenario, again, is that a plane has just crashed five miles offshore. So if you are driving by, or maybe you see it from a high rise if you live along the lakefront, there are going to be a lot of emergency responders down here. It is just a drill. But now I want to go up to Matt Salemi in News Chopper 12. Matt, some South Shore communities also going to be participating in these rescue training efforts. That's right, Hillary. We're along the lakefront in Cudahy here. There's going to be a separate training session today with firefighters from Cudahy and St. Francis teaming up with the Coast Guard for an ice fishing rescue drill. They'll practice finding, treating, and transporting patients from the water to local hospitals. So again, don't be surprised to see extra emergency crews all along the lakefront today from here in Cudahy all the way up into Milwaukee. Live in News Chopper 12, Matt Salemi, WISN 12 News.